and we are all from the Global Foundation for Ocean Exploration. Uh, we not only maintain and provide the RVs, but we also operate them, as you can see now, and are also responsible for all the footage you see. Glad you zoomed in there, because I was going to say when they finished that there's another tongue on yep. the bottom. That wow. That is a different one. That's a very long tongue. We get a little Probosis. closer to see if it goes back in. Probosis, right. Uh, much earlier in the dive, I had said that I thought I saw something that looked like a wiggly snake going back into a burrow, and I'll bet it was one of these. Oh, yeah, I remember <laughs> that. So, you know, so let's say that's a right meter so long yeah. for is the proboscis. The worm itself might only be five to ten centimeters long. <laughs> wow. Is that one of the males for the uh, cougar? I don't think so. It's like a... What is that? <laughs> a pteropod shell, just, I guess. <laughs> a very small hermit crab using oh, a pteropod is. shell. Oh my goodness, Isn't that I haven't funny? seen that before. I was wondering how that it shell is. was moving all by itself. Oh my gosh, so pteropods are planktonic gastropods, or planktonic snails. And they don't live on the seafloor, they are sort of at the mercy of currents. I get a lot currents. closer to this tongue video if you want to, you know. Oh, oh, here it goes. Uh -oh. Hope he doesn't take the... Uh, Gastropod away with it. Oh, look at that. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> oh, so that was all we were seeing <laughs> earlier. That was great. <laughs> 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 wow. Goodness, that was long.